This is what urologists at UT Southwestern Medical Center see when they chase down bladder cancer. You can see things that you can't see just by shining a typical light on them. That typical light is white. Here, the light is blue. I think this is just another step for our cancer center to stay on the cutting edge and offer the best diagnostic modalities for our patients. So how does blue light cystoscopy work? Patients arrive an hour early for their appointment. An imaging agent is put in their bladder. It's absorbed by cancer cells, which glow pink under the blue light. What's new is that there's a new flexible scope that allows you to use blue light in clinic, and that's now FDA approved. There were four sites that were given early access to these scopes. We're one of the first sites in the country. In fact, I think we did the first procedure in the country. And one of the first patients to benefit was Dr. Robert McMichael of Mansfield, Texas. It's a more sensitive test for bladder cancer, so, so if there is any cancer to be seen, the blue light cystoscopy significantly improves the chances that you'll see it on the cystoscopy. The father of two was diagnosed with bladder cancer about a year ago. What followed was surgery, then immunotherapy, and now screening every couple of months by UT Southwestern's Dr. Yair Lotan, who specializes in minimally invasive, robotic, and open surgical techniques. Once you have bladder cancer, you have to be under surveillance indefinitely. Bladder cancer is the fifth most common cancer in the U.S., the fourth for men and it has the highest rate of recurrence of all cancers, according to the National Institutes of Health. Almost everybody within the first year or two of diagnosis is at a considerable risk for recurrence. Studies suggest that low-grade bladder cancer returns in 30 to 50% of patients, while high-grade bladder cancer recurs in up to 70% of patients. That blue light cystoscopy will give me a chance to have a more effective surveillance to detect any recurrence earlier. I was glad to do it.